Well, let me say there are challenges everywhere. And uh, actually, when I was first elevated uh, as interim president and then president uh, at University of Cincinnati, that was right after the departure, sudden departure of my predecessor. So it's something that I have experience with, and it's something that uh, I believe I can help um, move the institution beyond. I think the university is in actually very good sh shape with Martha Piper, what she's done. But uh, that doesn't bother me at all. And this is fundamentally a world-class institution, and I look forward to working with uh, the members of this community to, to move it uh, from strength to strength. The first thing to do is, is to really listen uh, to the community, because as I said, the experts at UBC are the faculty, students, and staff. And the first thing to do is to understand the soul of the university, is what I like to say. And, and then to, um, to take the general vision um, that exists. There's an existing strategic plan that needs to be updated. And so I was speaking with the executive yesterday evening over dinner about uh, um, how to actually engage with the entire university community and provide specificity about what we're going to do moving into the future. And I also obviously have to do this in partnership with the governors and the chancellor uh, and, and, and the board chair. And those conversations are going brilliantly. And uh, those connections, that, that foundation is really important for uh, what's going to happen into the future at UBC.